Good morning, boys and girls. How are you? I'm so happy to see you, talk with you, and I'm gonna be so excited, so excited to hear that you've been having what? Making good choices. Remember those two words we talked about? Wisdom and knowledge. That you are doing that. We've asked God for wisdom and knowledge. I am so proud of you. Hope that you've been what? Doing good, washing our hands and doing what mommy and daddy has taught us, doing our schoolwork, making good choices. Because what? We ask God to make us have good choices, to let us listen, obey, and follow directions. I'm so happy, Miss Deborah, love you this month. Mm, mm, this month. Yes, I do. And Miss Priscilla, miss you so, so much. Maybe next time we can get Miss Priscilla on the phone and talk with her. How about that? Okay, so, uh-oh, we gotta do something. What did Miss Deborah didn't do? Oh, we didn't put on our thinking caps. Let's go, Miss Deborah. Come on, we got to put on our thinking caps. Hey, come on. Wee, good job. You know I'm gonna be laughing at you, boy. One more, here we go. Okay, Miss Priscilla, here we go, here we go. Let's go. Okay. Guess what? I don't think we're gonna sing a song this morning. You think we need to? Maybe we do one after a while. I think when well, you think of one, and we'll do it, okay? How about that? So, let's get started. The lesson has two words. Two words. How many? Two words. Wisdom and feast. Wisdom, feast. Wisdom, feast. Feast. And this is also found in the book of what? Pro Proverbs. Yay! Proverbs. You remember, y'all were so smart. You asked God to give you wisdom and knowledge, and you remember. You see that? Y'all are so, so smart. Y'all are so, so good. Yay! Miss Deborah, so proud. Miss Priscilla, we so proud. So the lesson has what? Two words. And we're talking about who? God? Then we still talking about this man. We still talking about this man. No. What was his name? Solomon? Solomon? Solomon. Yes, King Solomon. Okay. So listen up. The lesson has what? Two words. Two words. Let's go. Zero. One. Two. And the topic is wisdom feast. And it's found in what? Pro Proverbs, yes, Proverbs. So Proverbs, that is that in the back? Mm -hmm. What is that? Is it in the front? Mm -hmm. It's in the back? No. Okay, you said the. Y'all so good. The front, the front, and it's called Proverbs. And what and who are we talking about? God and the people. We're talking about God and the people. Okay, listen here. Some people are wise and some people are not. Some are wise and some are not. Wise people make what? Good choices. That they are good for them and help others. Wise people make choices that are good for them and help others others. Okay, you got that? How many words is the last saying? Two words. Two words. Let's count. Zero. One. Two. Okay? Wisdom's feast. Wisdom's feast. And it's found in the back or is it the front? Which one is it? Front. Good job. Front. Okay? So if it's in the front, it's called what? 
Proverbs. Okay, good job. And we're talking about who? God and the people. Okay, some people are wise and some people are not. When you are wise, you make good what? choices. When you don't make good choices, there's a what? Consequences. So people, some people are wise and some are not. Some make good decisions and some make bad decisions. Wise people make good choices that they are good, that is good for them and they help other people. Wise people make good choices for them and also they help other people. Wise people, they work very hard. Wise people work very, very hard. Wise people listen when they have advice. Wise people, they would listen when others have advice. Wise people listen to ones who have advice. Wise people listen to God and obey him. Uh oh, that's the main thing. God's people listen to him because he's going to give us, make wise decisions, make good choices wide decisions and make good choices. They listen to God and they obey God. That is being wise. You are listening to who God. Those who ask God for wisdom, who love God and who want to serve him are wise and live a life that blesses, that God blesses. Okay, let's do it again. Those who ask God for what? What's the W word? Wisdom. Who loves who? God. And who wants to serve him are wise and live a life that pleases who? God. And God blesses who? You, 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 and me. Okay, let's recap. How many words is the lesson? Two words. Two words. The topic of the lesson is what? Wisdom feast. What? Wisdom feast. Good job. Good job. And it's found in what book? Who? Uh -huh. Proverbs. Yes. Good job. Proverbs. And it's Proverbs. Is that in the back? Or is it in the front? Huh? Front. Front. Yay. Y'all so smart. Front. Okay. Who are we talking about? God and the people listen up some people are wise and some people are not some people are wise and some are not wise people make good choices they make good choices and they help other people they make good choices and they help other people Wise people work very, very hard. They work very, very hard, okay? Wise people, they listen to others when they give advice. They listen to others when they give you advice, how to do something, how to help you. They're listening from other people that's giving them advice. Wise people listen to who? God, and they obey who? God. Wise people listen to God and they what? Obey God. Those who ask God for wisdom, who loves God and want to serve him. Okay, that was a mouthful. Wise people listen and they ask God for what? Wisdom. Also, love God. They love God and they want to serve him and live the life that pleases who? God. They live the life, they love, they do what is right, and it makes God happy when we what? Listen, obey, and follow directions. But when, because we have what? Wisdom and knowledge. We have wisdom and knowledge. How do you know we have, how do you know we have it? It shows by you helping other people, by you loving other people, by you being kind 
and making good choices, not making bad choices. When we don't listen, we are making bad choices because what? Wisdom feast. Wisdom's feast. Okay, boys and girls, that is the end of our class and for the day. And guess what? You all are going to go home and you're going to tell mommy and daddy about our lesson. And you're going to ask them, do they have wisdom and knowledge? And then they're probably going to ask you, what is wisdom and knowledge? And then you're going to be able to tell them. Wisdom is being what? Listening to people who give good advice. You pray and you ask God for wisdom. You ask God for help. Um, you love. You make good choices. You are kind. You are helpful. You are loving. And you share. You share. Love is sharing. Okay? Tell mommy and daddy that you got wisdom and knowledge. Be good readers. Try to read a book a week. Okay? Get you a good little book and read the Bible. Don't forget to read the Bible each day. Remember, we have to pray and ask God for wisdom and knowledge. Okay? Bye-bye. I love you. See you next Sunday. Bye. Bye. Kisses, kisses. I love you. Bye-bye.